Hello, hello everyone, it's Plagin here, and today we're going to start a new little journey. So I've been looking for some Fallout full conversion mods, and for those of you who don't know what those are, it's basically Fallout mods that add basically either a whole new like main stories, or whether it's like, instead of going into the normal game, you go into a different game entirely, just using the same engine and atmosphere, you know, stuff like that. Um, a lot of them are, like, set to be released and stuff like that. Um, and, of course, I can't play them. Ones that look really great, like, for example, there's a Fallout London, Fallout Miami, and Fallout Cascadia, which are currently three huge ones that are uh, ones that I really want to play when they do come out, because they look real nice. Also, uh, Fallout The Frontier was one, and I did a playthrough of that, if you're all curious about it. But anyway, so I got a couple of them here, namely four, that I want to play, because uh, they looked halfway decent. And today I thought we'd start with the Fallout 3 one, and then there's two Fallout 3s and two Fallout uh, New Vegas ones. We'll just start with the Fallout 3 and then work our way up, right? Anyway, <clears throat> we're going to be journeying through Alton, Illinois. And according to the website, uh, it says that it features an expansive quest in which you can not only try to find your way home after ending up in uh, post-apocalyptic Alton, Illinois, but also two sides at the brink of war between two factions. During your time in Alton, you will play through a branching adventure that will have you choose which faction you side with for the rest of your stay, whether you side with Flag, a group of damned vault dwellers seeking revenge, or you fight with the Underground Railroad, the largest city in Alton. It includes various side quests, things to visit, you know, it's apparently twice the size of Point Lookout, um, completely separate from the Capital Wasteland, all that good stuff. So, already, uh, <clears throat> I'm going to be joining Plag, thank you very much. Uh, if that's a choice, that is, of course, what I'm going to pick. Name any faction plague, and I'm like, I am in. I'm just in it, right? Anyway, that's basically the gist of Alton, Illinois. Uh, so we're going to be doing that and seeing what's going on. As for the mods specifically that I'm using, we have, of course, the Alton, Illinois mod. Then we have the unofficial Fallout 3 patch and the uh, full-screen windowed mode. Uh, mod that does that, and the, the command extender, which you need for the things there. Other than that, I don't have anything else. I don't like to saturate uh, full conversion mods with a bunch of other mods, unless they specifically say, hey, these are ones that we recommend, which uh, this one did not really have many recommended ones. Uh, so I just decided not to do any of them. So anyway, we will be jumping on in and Going from there, let us switch on over the game. Got it on up. Oh, yes. So, it had been so long since I have played Fallout 3 that I forgot exactly how, like, long the opening was where you're a baby, then you're a kid, then you're a teenager and whatnot. Uh, so just to explain kind of what I did, I made a new character because I didn't have uh, an old one that wasn't modded. And I went ahead, went with special stats, 3, 3, 5, 8, 10, 3, 8. I like having high intelligence and charisma, and luck is also always good. I don't really care too much about strength because I don't use melee weapons a lot. Endurance is kind of just mid-tier. Perception is a little bit lower. I don't use explosives or energy weapons a whole lot. Uh, and agility is also just kind of there because I tend not to try to use vats as much. Thanks, Shadow Kong. But yeah, and then my skills that I picked, because I, I leveled up to 10 uh, just in, you know, uh, preparation for Alton, Illinois. just used a command to do that. These are my stats currently, as you can see here. I put most of it in lockpicking, science, medicine, repair, Small guns, because that's probably what we're going to be using, along with speech 100, because uh, why the hell not? 
As for the perks, well, I got my animal friend too. I got Bloody Mess, Commando, Daddy's Boy, Educated, Swift Learner, all the way to three. Those were the first ones I took, and Toughness. For those, that's kind of our general setup. I also went ahead and just gave myself um, a bunch of caps. As you can see here, I have 8,809. I started out with 10,000 caps, but a bunch, a bunch, bought a bunch of stuff. Namely, I bought the armored jumpsuit and a bunch of ammunition and all the stim packs that were in this town. Uh, all that good stuff. So as you can see, I've got all the ammunition here, even though I don't have guns for it. But I figured I would at least kind of go in to the Alton, Illinois uh, mod with a little bit of something. That way I could, you know, survive. And kind of go from there. But anyway, we're in Megaton, as you can see here. So we got a little ways to go. Um, yeah. The gate. We have a little ways to travel. And I believe the entrance to it is down in River City. So we've got a, you know, a little ways to go. But we should get there pretty quick, I believe. Just hop on down there. I also want to hit up a couple other shops. And ideally, I want to get more uh, weapons. I think that would be nice to have, you know? Weapons would be great. It's been so long since I played Fallout 3. Like I said, like, I... I did not realize how long the opening for it was, where you start out as your baby and then all that good stuff. And, uh, it was just ridiculous. So I'm real glad that I decided to do that before I started this up, or else it would have taken like an hour before we even got anywhere near there. Yeah, I'm not gonna deal with that. A little bit too much for my pistol right now. We're going to keep following this and going through wherever we're going. Yeah, the perks I chose specifically were uh, kind of help us out with, uh, of course, leveling up as we needed to go with the Swift Learner and all that stuff. But the, uh, the Animal Friend, never really taken that one before. And I figured I would grab it, kind of see what happened, because apparently animals won't attack you. It means like mole rats, like bad scorpions and stuff. They won't attack you, and they'll even come to your help with the perk, too. We're going to see how that goes. Because not getting attacked by things is nice. Especially when you're not prepared for it. Um, What button is the stim pack? So do you have to go into it? Oh, you actually have to go into the menu to do it here, don't you? It's been so long since I played Fallout 3. All the mods I normally get are for, like, Fallout New Vegas or Fallout 4. So it's been a been a minute. I also don't remember this place like at all. So it's gonna be a little bit of a walk. Also, my character just completely generic. It's like the, the default options because I figure why bother editing someone who is just going to be wearing a helmet anyway. You know, there's no real point in doing it. So yeah. Hmm, I'm remembering that we're gonna have to get across land infested by super mutants. I believe, in order to get to Rivet City. Right? Because it's uh, across the DC area. Or maybe it's like pretty close by, I don't know, we'll see. Get on that bridge, go across, and then see what the rest of the city is like, huh? How much else really changed? That I didn't really do much. I've gotten so used to, like, Fallout 76 and Fallout 4, where there's, like, a sprint. And, uh, this is just so slow for me right now. But, yeah, anyway. Beautiful, beautiful landscape stuff popping in and out. Yeah, from what I've seen of the, ah, what the hell, the screenshots of uh, the Alton, Illinois download, they, that download mod, they have things like uh, actual foresty areas, they have underground bunkers, you know, just exactly what you'd expect from like a Fallout game, right? So, I'm real interested to see how it goes. I'm also not sure how long it is. They say it's like twice the size of Point Lookout. But I don't know if that means like twice the... Uh, 
like quest length and stuff, or if it's gonna be over pretty quick. So I don't know how long uh, the actual is, you know. Okay, where are we at now? How far have we made it? I just gotta know. Oh, we're actually pretty close, okay. I was expecting it to take a little bit longer. Super mutants up there. Can I get across this? I just like bypass going underneath there. Does not look like I can. Okay. We're definitely gonna get shot at by some super mutants. Oh, speaking of. Go ahead and do this. I can feel my inside just dying here. Hold up, hold up. Stim back. Here we go. Give me your minigun. Give me your minigun. And your ammunition. Thank you. Minigun's not going to matter here. I'm just going to keep going. As long as I have another weapon, I'll be happy. Okay. Would like to get to another shop, though. Should be one on Rivet City if we're going there. We'll see. Getting closer. Oh, they saw me. That's way too many bullets to kill the super mutant, so I do not want to continue engaging them quite yet. Can I get around this way? I can. There's an invisible wall here. Yep, invisible wall. Okay, that's fair. I will just uh, get my way here. Isn't this the path that Liberty Prime comes down? Am I mistaken? Is this a building I can enter? Nope, okay. Curious, I wasn't gonna actually explore it. Okay, because there's Project Purity. Yeah, this is where Liberty Prime comes from. Comes down. Hey, Axel, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, we're uh, doing Fallout 3, uh, specifically a mod called Alton, Illinois. I'm actually heading there now, so we have to get to Rivet City quick to, to do it. But after that, we'll be in the mod and everything will be new and see how it goes. Ah, yes, more super mutants over there. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Might be tricky. Let me... I got the minigun. Wait for me to get in here. They're not. Looks down from that way. I can go around it. Oh. Oops. Oh. 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 Or at least the minigun will help me take out these guys and get me uh, a couple of weapons on our way. Go, hunting rifle. And what did you have? You had a hunting rifle as well. Yep. Where'd that shot come from? He's got a minigun too. Okay. Where? Got him. Let's heal up a little bit. Your minigun. Your ammunition. Thank you. Hey, uh. Cannot help while active in combat. Oh, well, what's down there? Huh? Yep, someone's down there. Okay. Hey, Super Muty. Go! Oh, hold on, I gotta reload. Hold on! And that's that, okay. Well. 
Pistol. There we go. Give me that sledgehammer. I need a melee weapon for now. You have nothing on you that I need. I'll go ahead and take everything from these boxes, though. Lock pick. Go. Ooh, more five millimeter. Line congressional style. Let's go with anything on the gore bags. Yep. Probably check the gore bags. They sometimes have ammunition in it. Oh, look, some grenades, too. Excellent. All right, let's go release this prisoner. We don't have to, but we might as well. And I want some more stuff from you. If I have, the easier it'll be down the road. What weapons do I got? I'll show you in just a moment. Let me finish picking this. Not much. I think I only have a hunting rifle, a 10 millimeter, and a minigun right now. than my current one. That. How about you, Raider? That. Let me search that guy. Hey, Wastelander. Uh, go. Be free. Ooh, an assault rifle. I'll take that Thank one. Thank you. Whoever. Look, I don't have anything to offer you except these supplies. I'll take that. Thank Here. you. Hey, she gave it more five millimeter. So yeah, my weapons currently are the hunting rifle. A mini gun, 10 millimeter, an assault rifle, and a sledgehammer. That's all. I basically just started, just got out of the vault, and uh, kind of went here. Okay, where in the hell am I now? I'm close, but I can't quite get where I need to be. Maybe I should have just stayed outside the uh, area here. I can't jump through, so I'm just going to toggle collision and walk through that. Go. I'm pointing all the way around. Just kind of side continent now, anyway. Ah, oh, there she is, Rivet City. Just gotta find the uh, merchants. I would like to get some extra weapons and stuff. You there? You sell stuff? Yes. Wolfgang. Welcome, sir or madam, to here to buy nothing but the highest okay, quality leftovers, see. junk, and crap. Nothing good. I'll take all your stim packs. Got a bunch of miscellaneous, which I don't care about. And I'll take your ammunition, because why not? What do I have to sell? <clears throat> get rid of the frag grenades. I don't like those too much. Keep everything else for now. Dog meat. Some whole wrap meat. Everything else I want to keep. Thank you. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Actually, can you repair stuff what? for me? Oh, go ahead and repair that. Let's repair all. Here we go. Hi. Peace. All right. Welcome to Rivet City. Please wait. It was always so cool in the beginning. Ooh. First time you see it, it's just amazing. Hold it right there. Sir? State your... Um... Like my father? And who might your father? Oh yeah? And I'm a fairy pr You keep up this smart- All right, all right. You can go on in. Yeah, yeah, I'll behave myself. Thank Everything you. Looks okay here. All the ammo crate down there, but I don't want to waste time to go get that. So let's see what we have. Marketplace. What do we need? Go to the marketplace, buy any ammo and weapons we want real quick. Stay away from me. No. I suppose. Life is my business. That's easy to say. Or 
Okay, she's not a merchant. You merchant? Here is flak and hey, flak. Okay, let's see. Your guns. Okay. <clears throat> Repair the guns real quick. So we got the 32, which doesn't matter. An assault rifle, which I already have one of. Do the Chinese assault rifle. Did they use the same ammo? Yeah. Chinese assault rifle does more damage. Just barely. Actually, no. It does a lot more damage because it's it, it is damaged. Let me take that. I'll give you this assault rifle. Chinese pistol, combat shotgun, which I will take. Batman hunting rifle, will leave. Five solid shotgun. Uh, the missile launcher. Silence 10 millimeter. You know what? I'll take that and sell you my current 10 millimeter. Uh, we got sledgehammer, switchblade, tire iron. Okay, nothing else. And the armor. I'm good. Take all your stim packs, please. And then I'll buy up all your ammo. All of it. I don't care what it is, just give it to me. Oops. There we go. And accept. Excellent. Okay. Thank you, Flack. A pleasure doing. Let me repair my stuff. Repair it all. Thank you. Gotta run. Now I got a decent arrangement of weapons. Is there a problem? Uh, thanks for the help. You're going to have a problem. Okay. That's just a tire. That's drugs. Why? Howdy, I'm Seagrave. I don't care about the power armor. I can't use it. What do you got to sell? Nothing. Barrel is. Radiation suit. I don't really need them. Oh, nothing better than what I got currently. Take all your stim packs, though. I think he's got some ammunition on him, so. Thank you much. Give me a shout if you. Hi. All right. Next. I don't think the attire guy has. Welcome to patrol armor, attire. right? But I'll check. Do business. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, no. No, no. All worse than what I got. It's been a pleasure. Thank you. Bye. Hey, Kim Lady. This is a I need some rattle and stuff. What do you got for sale? Okay. We got the Queen Ant Pheromones. Which I want. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Rat away. Impacts. Except. Thank you. A pleasure doing business. SMB. Bar. Any trouble in this area? Is that everything? Yep, that's everything. Okay, so let's head to Alton, Illinois. Let now that we've got a decent amount of weaponry and stuff on us, it's mostly repaired. Capital preservation. Okay, big ship open. Going not this way. Let's back out of that room and look. Gotta I'm go to the other side. Here. I'm looking for troublemakers. Should be down this hall. Maybe the end of it. Wait, is it taking me back to the marketplace? It is. I guess the stairwell specifically, huh? I'm supposed to be going to the metro tunnels. I'm guessing it's lower, right? Be somewhere around here. Not the muddy rudder. Gotta be up, I guess. Okay. <clears throat> oh. Is it behind this door, perhaps? I think I'm stuck. Okay, no, I'm not. <laughs> Keep going up. Just a sec. Is it? That just goes back to the market. Oh, maybe it's outside. Yeah, it makes sense it was outside. Look here. Yeah, it's it's not Rivet City itself. It's it's outdoors. Okay. It makes more sense. All right, let me check my weapons again here real quick. Start with the silence ten with me. Here. Do a quick save because it's been a while. I think. 
here. Oh, is it this portal here? Ah, it is. All right, we're in the utility tunnels. Build the Mr. Ghoul. Oh, he doesn't set off traps. Okay. Well, in that case. Oh, shit. What do you got? Ball caps? I'll take it. I rest here real quick. I think if I rest, I'll get my health back, right? Yeah, I will. Going this way. Maybe? I don't seem to be able to get through here, though. But why? Let's to find a way into it. Okay. So let's just check back the way we came, because there was another door. If nothing else, I'll just cheat through it, but at least check. Found the tripwire. And I'll take these grenades, thank you. Fire's a key. Really? Hmm. Don't say. Is there a key here? There is a key, okay. Look a roundabout process, I guess. Oh, that was a great critical hit. Oh my god. Rat X, I'll take that. Is there anything there? Dead settler. Ooh, baby, a scope magnum. Take that. Refrigerator got nothing. Yeah, let's go. Buff out. Books. Crates. Metal. Blocks. Anything in this one? Nope. The best weapon I got right now? Uh, probably... I mean, the missile launcher is kind of the best damage-wise single target, but we're talking about, like, how much, like, ammo and stuff. Probably the shotgun or the Chinese assault rifle, I would say. Wouldn't take all that. Bottle cap, barrel goo, lunch box. Okay, let's keep on down. Come on. Come on, gooly gooly gooly. Easy peasy. Oh, God. Hello there. Ah, damn it. Go. Okay. Anything here that's of use? Not really. Not. Okay. Metro ticket. What if I'll need that? Keep that in mind. Don't think that I'll need. Oh. Am I ready to do anything? Not. Toolbox. I guess I just. Sound like something big moved back upstairs. Is on the way here? Oh, God. Okay, let's go back up. That gate should now be out of the way. And watch them be like, we're gonna take all your guns and stuff. So none of what I did matters. Let's see. 
Oh, hello there. Hey. For the hood outcast. Okay. Open terminal. Airport controls. Commander Atkins, huh? For you. For the hood outcast. Anything here I can loot? Hey there. It wasn't red. It's mine now. <laughs> Ammo's ammo, right? All right, let's talk to this guy. Dave. So you're the new recruit. Aren't you a bit scrawny for this job? Fine. We'll take whoever we can get. Look, I'm going to tell you straight up the no bullshit version of what to expect. You're probably going to get the living hell shot out of you. We received a long-distance distress signal from the West Coast a few days ago, meaning the Brotherhood is in trouble. We both know Lyons is going to stay holed up and rot. We're the only ones who have both the courage and the technology to go help. Wouldn't the plane's motherboard have been fried during the war? You one of those tech guys trying to sound smart all the time? Well, I don't have time for that, and frankly, I like you less than I did before. I have enough of you techies already. All you have to worry about is buckling your seatbelt before we take off. Shouldn't be too hard for you. If you do manage to get back alive, there will be quite a reward to be had. But if you want to make it back, you're going to have to do what I say. Once you decide to go to your journey to the west coast, there will be no going back until you complete the playthrough through of the mod's main quest. Ready to go. Alright then. Let's get the show on the road. Boys. Move out. They just gave me a key to a Boeing. Okay. I didn't know Boeing's had keys. Well, I'm guessing they have like some sort of ignition system. But I have the key. Here we go. Now I can RP walk with them. Yeah. That is a, uh, a plane. A little bit poorly textured. Looks like it's a little bit messed up, though. Are we gonna, are we gonna ride this plane that looks like it's been like shot at a bunch? Is this what we're doing? Like, I guess there's only so many like plane textures you can use in the uh, the base Fallout game for a mod, so. Got it, it's absolutely insane. How am I in the pilot's quarters? Sir, why am I up here? Okay. So, uh. You gonna be okay? This looks like a vertebrate uh, cockpit, to be honest. Uh, man, who could have saw that coming? The condition the plane was in. Oh my god! And I loot them. Alton, Illinois. Before the war, the city flourished as a leading steel manufacturer making everything from automobiles to assault rifles. Once a quiet riverside town, people flocked to the area in search of jobs, but in the two hours that were the Great War, the city was silenced. However, life, as it does, moves forward. Vault 59 sheltered hundreds from the fires above, as did natural caves along the riverside bluffs. Small settlements quickly grew into bustling towns. Trade routes were established, but two years ago, the crazed inhabitants of Vault 59 emerged, bringing nothing but fire and death. One month ago, super mutants moved in from the west, seizing Southern Alton and the town of Godfrey. This is where you come in, newcomer. You will make choices that will forever change the fate of Alton.
I'm alive. Imagine that, survival plane crash. Holy shit, you're away. What happened? Well, judging by your parachute over there, it probably ripped on the way down. Man, you should have seen the explosion that plane of yours made. I can't believe you actually survived that fall. I had a parachute? Where am I? Welcome to Alton, currently ranking number one in worst place to live. I'll be worst place. typical raiders, super mutants, and other creatures. But there's also the plague. The plague. The plague is a cult of cast out bastards that have been burning down everything in Alton for the sake of revenge. First reported attacks started about two years ago, and that's when things went to hell. What happened? They invaded our homes, stole our food, and burnt our towns to the ground. That's what happened. They're probably the most dangerous thing out here. And they're also the ones who stole your gear. Why they left you alive it. is beyond me. Well, let's get it back. I like how you think. They're likely holed up in Bellevue. Here's some armor and a gun get you through. Let's go! Man, I knew it. I absolutely knew they were going to take my goddamn stuff from me. Why did I even try? I still got my bobblehead, though. Got it. Okay. Anything around me I can loot real quick, though? Hold up. For me, wait, wait, wait. Up. Oh, okay, let's go. Eeny, me, me. Get the hunting rifle. Single shot weapons are just meh. What are you shooting at, my dude? Hey, is that my silence 10 millimeter, sir? Quick save here. Mm. <gasps> okay. We 100% are joining this group. No. Have the plague doctor masks? Oh my god. Hello, yes, I would like to join. Where do I apply? You. You're new to this place. Who are you? Why are you here? Their mic qualities aren't the best for recording the voice lines. Who are those people? Why'd you kill them? My plane crash on the way. Tell you the brother could. Yeah, can do that one. You survived a plane crash. Impressive. And you said you were from the capital. Tell me, what treasures can be found at such a place? Oh. The Brotherhood of Steel. But they haven't been seen for ages. Oh, what must lie beyond this insignificant town. Excuse me. I'm getting ahead of myself. My name is Stephen Clark, leader of what these people call the Plague. You're in Alton, Illinois. The ruins you stand in were once called Bellevue. This is what happens to those that ignore our cries for help. Cries for help? Me, along with a few hundred others, were trapped in Vault 59 for many years. The things that place did to your mind? It was maddening. Our water chip had long since broken, and our food supplies were dwindling. Our last hope was a distress beacon, which we prayed would reach the waste. No one came to our aid. Months later, a scout from the town of Godfrey picked up the signal and managed to open the door from the outside. They had been the only ones to help us. He told us that traitors passed through the area quite often, and would have easily been able to hear the signal. We have greater need for your equipment than you do. That is bullshit. We aren't exactly swimming in weapons. Give me my stuff back. I'm a one-man army. Come on. I don't want to say this. I want to join them. Oh, well. You could have gone on to do great things with me. Goodbye, newcomer. Are they going to New Vegas me? Oh. <laughs> ah. Really? That's how we're going to play it, huh? That's how it's going to be? A jail cell? Hmm. Find your equipment. We didn't find out who stole it. Okay. Why would they not just kill me though? Like they just blatantly shot that group of people. They're like, we'll, we'll, you know, put this guy in a cage. 
That'll be fine. Well, that plan didn't work out so well, did it? Yeah, where were you? Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. Anyway, your gear is likely upstairs, seeing as this is the only building not on fire. I don't think anyone besides that poor fellow I shot on the way in heard me, so you should be able to catch anyone upstairs off guard. I'll stay down here in case you manage to land yourself in another jail cell. Good luck. Hey. Wait. Is it... Oh, I don't have any bobby pins, so it's not doing it, but it's still doing the animation. That's... Bizarre. Jet. I don't care, though. <laughs> Y'all done messed up now. Now I have the plague helmet. Look at me. I am the plague boy now. Oh, but... <clears throat> Some intestines, okay. Why wow, they have coffins in here? So weird. First of all, let's loot the first floor. Maybe I'll find a gun or something that'd be nice. No. Otherwise, I'll just beat the hell out of them with a bat. Okay, yeah, there's nothing on the first floor. Let's go. Hey, mask. suitcase got food convenient 10 millimeter and a gun anything in here oh a Chinese pistol all that all right Turn off the light over here shut up Break his kneecaps! Where are you running to? There's nowhere to run. We're in a house. I think you done messed up now, buddy. Now I have heavy plague armor. Can I repair the uh, heavy play with the light flag? I can. And repair past 100%. Okay. I keep trying to press the number keys to switch weapons. I can't. There we go. All my gear come to me. Now I'm a little bit overweight. I see. Okay. Well, heavy plague is 15. That. Okay, we'll drop that. Uh, what, what props? There we go. Drop that helmet. Oops. Drop the raider armor. And a baseball bat. Damn. Keep pressing the wrong buttons to close out of stuff. Let's get rid of that. And we are in perfect weight now. Speech increased by one. So great since my speech was already at like max. Okay. Activate the plague terminal. One month. One month. One month is all we give you. Railroad will file by our hands just as the others have. What does that mean? Equip one. Up in. Hunting rifle for now. Huh? Oh. All right. Are you, Rendo. Anything they're worth looting? Is that a doctor's bag. Hold up. Nope, that's just a thirty-two and cigarettes game. Cigarettes. Anyway, what did you find? And that's a little loud. Show him the note. It was only a matter of time. That's my home. I've lived there all my life. We have to warn them. Let's head there then. I'm not so sure Hartrick will trust you. 
but we'll see when we get there. But I want to start with the plague, though, my man. I guess I kind of got to meet everyone first before they all be like, okay. Now you can choose a side. Oh, man. What is... What is... What is that in my view? The, uh, the gauntlet's spike? Where are we going? Where am I at? Data. Roadmap. Okay. Ways away. Actually, can I see how big this area is? Hippos error 28. It doesn't seem all that big. Uh, maybe it's kind of fine if we look over this way, I guess. I don't know. Anyway. You move towards the next objective. Oh, there's like the DC ruins over here, huh? We discovered wild track break. This. Ah. Meet up with other people first. I don't have a lot of storage space, like loot things, quite yet. Wait. Oh, they're raiders. Uh, did I kill that? Surely not. Right? Oh, he was on it. Ah, there we go. Got him. Accuracy, this is not great. What you got on you? And his pistol? Take it. The other one go. Oh, he was a little further up. What you got? Fire iron? Meh. Not intro. Blood flies? Crap. Gun, please! Please, gun, please. Hey, two experience from those? Really? Don't say. What's we getting? Okay, we're nowhere near. You know what might be better than the hunting rifle? Chinese pistol which uses the same ammo? No, it does not. Uh, the 32 pistol that uses the same ammo. That does less damage, but I can probably fire it quicker and more accurately. Ironically enough. Crossing this bridge. Cup of Joe! So quiet. Mailbox. Funny that the uh, mailbox on its side is the one that actually has stuff on it. Oh, the USPS. Oh, are we going across the bridge? Is that what we're doing? It looks very like what we're going to be doing. Unless it's that building. But we're going to a city, right? Cross this.
Oh, no, they call it the Underground Railroad because... Okay, I'm just gonna talk with Collision. Yeah. Here we go. Boop. Call the Underground Railroad because it's an Underground Railroad. I see. Wouldn't they just call it the Underground? Instead of adding Railroad to it, which makes it sound like the Brotherhood. Not Brotherhood, the, uh... Those people things. I'm not talking to you. John Hartrick? That's far enough. Who are you? I'm your president. Oh my god. Plane crashed and people died. And how am I supposed to believe that? For all I know, you could be a member of the plague trying to get inside. I tell you what, we've had a problem with some of the conductors who rigged up a few years back to keep the underground railroad powered and heated. For the past few weeks, they've started to fail. As you can see by the lack of light, we're in an outage right now, and we need somebody to fix them. That person is you. Tom Howard, the local repairman, just rigged us up a new batch of conductors. You'll need to replace the faulty ones with these. The entrance to the utility tunnel is just south of here, by St. Clair's Hospital. Get in, replace the conductors, and report back to me. It seems a little, like, important to be trusting, like, a random person with, right? Especially someone you're suspecting of being part of the plague, someone who's wearing the plague armor, you know? But here, here take these uh, conductors that a repairman slaved over and uh, make it so we have power and stuff again. A little bit too trusting there. Although, I guess it's not trusting because they're not letting me in, right? Bill. Not that place. Next to a hospital. There's that bridge. Would have been the perfect place for like a city or something. Oh, another. oh it's the plane wreckage. Well, damn. Everything's burned to a crisp, though. Dad will be able to get anything from it. What a shame. There's a surprising lack of things around shooting at you in here, though. That might be my one, like, complaint about the mod so far. Is that... It's just like dead, you know. I'm not gonna step on that. You know, requires a key. Do I not have a key? Do I have to walk on this? Oh. Okay, I understand. Not screw you, Pectron. Screw you. I keep hitting space. It's the same one that Fallout 76 was. Oh, ho, ho. There you go. Definitely a lot quicker than using the hunting rifle, that's for damn sure. Target identified. Area firing. Where's it at? There it is. Oh! Ow! You can't come through the ground and shoot me like that, bro? Come on. It's illegal. Okay. Now then. Kind of funny. Give me your energy cells. You right, firing weapons. Could have warned me out of the rounds, too, though, you know. Your energy cells, thank you. Oh. Yeah, 
turret. Two, three. Go. Easy. I uh loot the turret. Medical box. Impact. Medical brain. And working. Moving on. And boop. Not dead. Boop. There we go. Uh Exit. Blew up. Oh. Well, that gate's gone now. At least we can move up this way, huh? What caused the explosion, though? Also... This led me straight to the underground railroad. Ooh. They had like a back entrance to get into it. Kind of messed up. They didn't tell me. Metro card. I'm just gonna remind me. Care about the negative. You stole. What do you mean? Flat. I'm sorry. What do you need? I need to get going. Yeah, yeah. You run away. Flat. There's a key. Came from there. We got in here. The bathroom, don't care. It's probably also another bathroom, right? Yep, this is the men's, you can tell. What do you need? Yes, that's locked. Who are you? Yes, Railroad settler? I need to go now. I can see you eyeing it. See this, pants grab. Where am I going? We're gonna be real surprised when I just walk up behind him and be like, hey, I finished your tax. I'm Howard. What can I do? You heard my stuff? Oh, obviously this guy is uh, real skilled at repairing stuff, huh? For my armor. Where my magnum, please? My combat shotgun because I love that thing. That one too. The minigun. Down here. I'll see you later. Bye. Kind of like a refugee camp in a way. Where am I? Okay, I'm just creeping into this guy's. So... Oh, can I have that, sir? I mean, detect that he's sleeping. Got here. Infiltrator. I'll take that. Thank you. Open desk. Yeah. We got here. Long off shotgun doesn't matter. Bottle caps. I'm not going to steal those individually. Look, I'm detected. Hold on. Walk away a little bit. There we go. Now I'm hidden. See that, 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 and that. Oh my god. Don't do it! I'm gonna have to reload. Because I was hidden, wasn't it? But he suddenly decided to wake up. Oh, 
put them to death. You're safe. Save again. Here. Watch your stuff. A little more. There we go. Take it off. Force it. Oh, yeah. Force it. Nope. No, I forgot if you do that, it locks it. Oh, my God, whatever. Save. Sir, I completed your thing. Staying out of trouble. Don't mind the stuff I stole. You know what? I was wrong about you. You've really done us a favor, newcomer. Our lives about to get a whole lot easier thanks to you. What can we do to repay you? Uh, how about some caps? Do I have for the equipment? Because if I can get that gun, that'd be cool. I doubt it would be that easy. No way they're gonna give me that gun, right? Sure. Well, oh, Stimpax, I'll take those. Myself. The name's Hardrick. This is the Underground Railroad. One of the few towns left in Alton. This is Alton? Sure is. Smack dab in the middle of the United States. Alton used to be a pretty nice place to live. Well, compared to the surrounding area. But then the plague showed up. Thanks, what the hell? They claimed they're out for revenge. And have gone around burning every town they come upon. The only town that's managed to stay out of it is New Godfrey. No idea why that is, but Godfrey has problems of its own. Anyway, where are you from, newcomer? You see? Wow, that's a long ways away. You looking for a way home? Mm-hmm. Well, I'll be used the least I can do to repay you. But I don't have any ideas. Except for walking. You might know is the self proclaimed mayor of Godfrey. Why is it in quotes? A ways north from here. I'll mark out on your map. Don't bother telling him I said anything. Thanks for your help. I, I want the gun though. But you have the infiltrator now, at least. <laughs> oh, yeah. This baby's good. Okay. Well, go ahead. And I'm assuming I gotta go up. Get out of here. Jump. Thank you. you can't walk. See anything you like. What you got? I have a fine collection of items. I'm a little bit low on ammunition, good sir. So I'm gonna sell you some stuff I don't really need. Barrel, light flag armor, blood pack, dirty water, FedEx, FedEx, if I'd water, cigarettes, sir. Definitely not going to use any mini news. Those things are a recipe for suicide. What do you actually have? There. Ooh, power armor. That I can't use because I don't have the perk for it. Impacts. Minions. Ammunition. What do you got? Actually, what does my infiltrator use? This is 556. So let's buy all you got of that. And. Uh, the 5 mil. Got any 44s? You do. Thank you. Take the shotgun shells as well. And it's that. Thank you, sir. Bye. Goodbye. All right. 
Well, we said it was north, right? But it doesn't seem like it can go much north. That doesn't seem like north, right? It seems like south. Yeah, that's southeast, my oh, man. Or is this is gonna lead me to like another map? Or something? Question mark? Sun. Blinding. We're gonna go this way. If that semi has anything in it, take a look. Bunch of small metal boxes, which are mostly gonna be empty more than likely. Bunch of crap and stuff. Meh. Don't need it. I was never really big into Fallout 3's mechanic of building weapons and stuff. So. Kind of always just ignored that stuff. Mmm, that looks healthy. Come back past this raider camp, I believe. Should have probably installed some sort of sprint mod. It would come in handy. But I did a uh, playthrough of Morrowind recently. I uh, cheated up my speed stat so that I could like sprint around very quickly. It was so nice. I was like flying around. Ah, oh, good stuff. gonna find what here hello hello seriously <clears throat> yeah my one problem with this mod is that there's nothing like anywhere there's no monsters come to attack me randomly no raiders that are just around me there's this guy here but you know am i seriously missing Okay, I think I was missing because I wasn't holding the trigger down, and I should have been. Also, why am I killing the flag? This is messed up, man. I don't like laser pistols, so we'll leave those alone. What's this? I need an assault rifle and a bunch of mags. Oh my god. Look at that. I forgot the China. this uh, <coughs> infiltrator is an automatic. That's a grenade, that's a grenade, that's a grenade! Woo! Got on you. Just a knife, I don't care. Oh, gods! You always run that risk when you, uh... Shoot someone with... <clears throat> gory mess after you've already killed them they just always explode it's hard to keep track of their bodies what's this gun cabinet cool cabinet Psh. what we got down here nothing all right well we'll do a quick save and can you walk in here yeah hmm Let's check out this place. Probably got some of these boys in it. Yep. You want some too? Come on. Ouch. 
you got on you. Bottle cap, I'll take that. You got a sawn off shotgun, right? Yep. Shotgun shells. Alright, let's take a quick. How long does an hour regenerate for health? All of it. Okay, cool. Works for me. And the one downside of this gun is that it is just eating through durability. Addition. Hmm. Yeah, so it seems like the only place that enemies are going to be at, or like anything that I need to shoot for that matter, is going to be around locations. Because those one raiders we fought previously, they were uh, around a base area. And those guys were around that house. Which is unfortunate. I mean, part of Fallout is just roaming around and seeing stuff that wants to kill you, right? And killing it before it can kill you. But there's really nothing to break up the uh, the mundane. Uh, the moving from point A to point B. There's this guy here who raider, but they're probably defending whatever is on this bridge as a waypoint, right? Do not take your shotgun shells and your combat shotgun. Thank you. Force this lock. It looks like I made it. All that. A nuclear cola machine. A nuclear cola. Yeah, they're defending some sort of camp down there. I don't really feel like running all the way down there when the objective's in the opposite direction. Or is it here? I don't know how far I've gone. Yeah, it's definitely not here. But I think I can go through these uh, areas. Running on top of the railroad. Ugh. Ah, I made it. Get me down near there, right? Also, I'm not just hearing things. The, the guy did say that Godfrey was north of the railroad, right? Or did he say it was north of something? To be fair, north and south are pretty similar, right? They both end in a th sound, right? I could have just easily ignored what he was saying. And it actually was south. They should have made the map a lot smaller. Like, it's one thing to like be like, yeah, so we... Uh, have two times the size of Point Lookout, but if there's nothing there... What do you need? Not really a reason? You know? And in Ranch, I don't know. Alton Ranch, huh? Good to see you. Hasn't the plague taken this place over yet? Yes? He had different armor on it, though. So. Thought he would say something different, but nope. The small town that, you know, doesn't matter. In terms of things quite yet. Oh god. I can gray here, different colors here. And I'm like black from this end. <laughs> Textures on this are insane. Weird. Now I'm kinda of tannish. Very, very weird. Very peculiar. Is that where I'm going? I think it is. Oops. Of course. Hello, anybody here? Is that a plane? I like it. Part of one. Good save. Please, do you have any water? All abs are radiated. I've been drinking whatever I can find, but I can't do it anymore. Please. 
What if I can date to Godfrey? Okay. Pretty shitty town, just like every place in the wasteland. Apparently I'm talking to this guy. Hold up, traveler. What's your business here? I was told I could fix find some help. Damn Patrick. it. I'm sick of Hartrick sending his problems to me. The name is Robert Johnson. Well, what do you need? This guy's actually quite good at his voice acting right now. Um My plane crashed and I got my belt home on a ride home. Well, I might have a ride for you, but it's not something I'd easily let go. You'll need to do something for me first. This town is called New Godfrey for a reason. We used to live in what is now Old Godfrey, but super mutants took over the place. We want Old Godfrey back. Well, yes, go and blow a few heads and I'll get my back home. Exactly. Get rid of the super mutants and report back to me. We've also heard reports of the mutants moving further north, up in some hills east of the Dust Bowl. Clear out Godfrey first, then search the camp. Oh, one more thing. I had a dog, but I couldn't find her before we fled the town. If you can at least find out what happened to her, I'd be really grateful. She'd still be in my room, towards the back of our living quarters. Uh, how long have you guys been living here for? Because if your dog's been there for like days or a week, they're probably gonna die, or probably on the verge of death, right? Okay. Why is New Godfrey so far away from Old Godfrey? It seems like this place is better because it's more defendable, right? It's got these like nice big walls around. Granted, they're in the aid of the enemy because an enemy could just go over there with a sniper and just wait, heck you guys off. But, I mean, there's there's the scrap walls around to kind of form a dome. Seems like it's a more defensible, right? I don't know. A weird. What, what guns do I have? Hunting super mutants, this one's not going to cut it, I don't think. Get the 44 out for a moment. I don't have any bullets, but... At least I can use that, then I can pull the missile launcher out when I get closer. Yeah, why? You won't attack me though. It's a good boy, aren't you? You're a good boy, aren't you, you little yeah boy, yeah. I wish I could pet you. Pet. <clears throat> I think not being attacked by those guys is probably the best thing that the uh animal perk thing did, but Hey mole rat, how you doing bud? Pat pat on the head and let's go. So there's animals here, but like nowhere else. And they don't seem to wander, they just seem like they're standing there. Okay. This is just a... Uh, weird little defended shack? Here it goes off! Okay. A lot of iron up here. Really an enemy of some sort. Who the hell are you, sir? Sir? A flag sniper, huh? Oh, let's go ahead and shoot him in his arm a couple of times. Oh, I can't hold your sniper like that, can you? This is the wrong guy, buddy. Take your sniper, bud, thanks. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay. Sniper up here, I guess. Okay. Usually snipers operate in teams, for the most part. These guys might just be stupid to realize that. Hello, super muties. Watch the, uh... His ants aren't friends. Watch old Godfrey. Be like a real crappy place. Uh, whip that shot. Get wrecked. Blah. Ah. Hate insects. Well, you want some too, huh? That's 
What's up? Is this old Godfrey? This fungus thing. Damn. No way this is old Godfrey. No, no. Still further south. We're we getting multiple markers. Undoubtedly. I uh have to kill multiple things outside. Is this the Dunwich building? I mean, obviously not, but it looks like it's what I remember the Dunwich building looking like in the original Fallout 3. Maybe they just might have reused it, right? <clears throat> Let me just climb over this. I would laugh if this was old Godfrey. It would just be like, oh my god, I would die. <gasps> what the fuck? Okay. Well, whoever's there is not happy. Am I close? I'm not even close. This is not even the place I need to be. Well, they're gonna have to die though. They shot me. <gasps> A dog. Who kills doggos? Messed up, man. Please. Bats, please. Get him. Oh, not like that. Oh. Oh, I got him. Kill your officer, losers. Okay, let me uh, use a couple stim packs here. Which weapons? Say hello to my little friend. Let's go. Uh, gun? Fire him, please. Okay. <clears throat> He's down. Reload, reload, reload! For Eden. President Eden. Oh. Take all that. Ah. I want the plasma guns. I think it's laser rifle. Don't mind that. Hey, okay, leveled up! Death Claw, Cage Key. That'll be useful. Oh no. Oh no. There we go. The, uh, the minigun glitch was happening. All right, so what do I get up next? Repair, kind of important to get my weapons up to service, but I can also increase big guns since I'm using missile launchers and miniguns. Maybe we'll do that. Increase that to make it more deadly. Yeah, there's a minigun. All right, what are we getting here? Daddy's boy, I increase science and medicine, which I don't need right now. Intense training, no. What about the bottom ones? Down here, down here. Robotics expert, more damage to robots. Don't think we're gonna be doing many robots. Um, that's metabolism. You gain more health when using stim packs. Oh, I'll take that. I have to use less stim. Oh, hey there, buddy. You, uh, good, mate? I'm gonna have to close that. One of those yahoos threw a goddamn plasma grenade at me, though. And a Monclave base out here, okay. Reported sightings. Monclave field base 4, backup tape. There is a good amount of resources for FEV production. Ah. So the Enclave probably FEV'd the area. And cause the super mutants to attack the town. Why? Why is this irradiated? I mean, I guess it looks like a nuclear crater, kind of. Not really. Yes, Shadow, this is a minigun. Hey, let me out, please. <coughs> Right now to use some rat away. No. Okay. We're we'll getting close to the uh, super mutants now. Perhaps. Maybe. Is this old Godfrey? 
I guess they have a solid wall here, huh? But oh, do I have to go into each building individually and clear it out? Is that what this is gonna be? Looks like it's pointing right here. Yep, okay. Shotgun time! Let's go. Of course, more radiation. Damn! I don't think they're gonna have any ammunition on them since they uh, tried to melee me to death. Is there anything else here? There's like a, a marker here, but nothing to do here. No second floor, underground, okay. Oh. Crap. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap! Oh, you son of a bitch. He's running away. Yeah, yeah, I know how to heal them. You got on you, huh? Nail board? What are these, like, ill-equipped super muties? That didn't do much, did it? Oh. Hit them both! Wow. Accuracy, what? Seriously? That missed! Oh my gods. Missile launcher, why do you suck? Minigun, I need you. Alright, let's reload. Before we go around. Go. Oh. Just gotta come off the wall, huh? Boink. I got the Okay, I'll admit it. New Godfrey kind of has some decent uh, defenses to it, or old Godfrey, I guess. Fire! 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 Okay. Shock on time again. Knock, knock. Oh, fuck, it's a centaur. Yeah? over here, huh? Surprised I haven't eaten him. Is that a quantum? Is hell yeah, baby. This is a weird pharmacy if they got like a surgical clinic back here. Anything else here? Bunch of nasty meat. Okay. Hope this place is secure. Moving on to the next one. We got that. We got that. Everything else is inside. Or that one also. God damn it. 
to clear this building. That sucks. What the hell just like exploded? Killed five out of the twenty super mutants. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh along the road. There we go. Go. Easy. I'll take this five mils. Then. Oh, this guy decided to just blow up for. Did he kill himself with a grenade when I came in here? Back here, it seems. Bro, mutant. Yeah, yeah. I'm coming for you. Don't you worry. Shipment. Oh boy. Okay. Um, maybe? Nope. Well, it's not an ING ending, so no. I have, nope. Ah, uh, it could be everyone. Nope, it's not everyone. All right, let's see. Looking for bugs, looking for bugs. One. Ah, uh, there's two. Three. I need my... Prize reset is what I really need. Uh, come on, eyes, where are we going? Oh, it's not that one. Not that one, or that one, or that one, or that one. Where did everyone? So it's gotta be Mainland? Okay. <clears throat> that works for me. Let's engage lock. Hello. I'd be surprised if there were super mutants in here. Take guns and bullets. Rifle man, lob man. First empty gun cabinet. Barrel shotgun, don't care. What is rifle man's lament? 50 damage, huh? What's the infiltrator do? 48. We'll test it out. Also, I'm going to use a stim pack real quick. Man, I gotta say, I do not miss having to go into my inventory every time to use stim packs. Okay, this is a good gun. Got on you. To the left. A little more, a little less. Okay. So just barely to the left then. Perfect. That was so worth it. Pencils, man. I was playing Fallout 76. That'd be the fucking jackpot right there to get lead. All right, there's still some boys upstairs. I killed half the super mutants up here, I guess. Nothing to the left there, so. I already swept through that basement area. Already did over that area, so we'll go in now. Oh, super muty. Super muties. Kicks open door. Shoots in the face. Reloads the gun menacingly. Go. 
This was just the hallway that loops around here, right? Yep. Okay. Godfrey Settlers. Puking his guts out on the toilet. That over encumbered me? Okay. Right, that's fair. That's fair. Uh, aid. Here we go. <clears throat> Thank goodness ammo does not like weigh anything. <laughs> yeah, boy. Oh my god, this is the best foot locker ever. A whole nothing inside of it. All right, I hear another one. At least one more in this building. There he is. Got everything? Data. Optional, find their dog. Well, I think that's everyone here because there's nowhere else to really explore. So, let's go outside and... Get the rest of them boys. Also gotta find that guy's dog. The rest of them should be inside the actual main facility. What was this? Some sort of prison? Why is there like door here? Around here real quick. Also, if there's a dog, it's totally dead, right? Like no way the super mutants would not eat it. First, right? Pizza parlor. Pizza now. Fantastic. There we go. Wreck nerd. No more game. Lines. I don't want those. There we go. Got him. 15 out of 20. Okay. This area is clear then. Going on out. That dog has to be dead. If I was a super mutant, I'd be like, I hear animal behind this door and break it open and eat the dog. Hold on, reloading, wait! Oh. <laughs> Restaurant. That's 15, 16, 17. Wait, what? That was only 17. I guess that was all the ones in Old Godfrey? But where's... What? I, I, Hold on. So they said to find his dog in his room, but there's no, like, room? There's the apartments. There's Walgreens Pharmacy. They call it Wally Greens Pharmacy. Nice. Pump station. The only place it could be would be in the apartments, but there was no, like, locked doors or anything in there that I couldn't get into, right? Well, it's all uh, journey on down to the next area, and yeah, I'm just fast traveling to that area. Screw this! Oh, unless they took his dog to this camp, maybe. Why they would waste the effort doing that? Yeah, old old Godfrey sucks compared to their new place. Like old Godfrey has like a wall surrounding two restaurants, um, and then the rest of the more important areas, the clinic, the apartments, and uh, the pump systems, they're all outside of their wall. How would they want to move back when they have everything surrounded by a lovely wall in New Godfrey? No, I don't understand their logic.
Hasta la vista, baby. Super mutants. Knock them out wherever you are. So if we're still going off the numbers from before, that would have been 19. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Right, um, hold on. Uh, item, weapon. We have a couple sniper rifles, right? Yeah. Combine those and. Hold on. That's definitely rig tail. Oh. oh. It is a good thing I stopped, or else she would have been dead. But super mutants can't leave these kind of traps. Untire. God. Someone. My. Here, I managed to hide these supplies before they tied me up. I'll take them. Get out of here. Here. <laughs> and it went off anyway. All right. Go. Run home, lady. Dank slaughterhouse. You have the dogs probably here, huh? Oh, I thought there'd be another super mutant here. I've only killed 19, right? Unless I'm miscounted. Oh my god, lock picking, please! Thank you. Oh, five millimeter rounds. I was low on those too, so. A couple of dead raiders. Much. What else we got? Important. The locker. What do you got? Leather armor? Meh. Why not disarm when I have the chance, right? Or detergent. Alright, there's nothing else here. Oh, ah, Jesus hello, fucking comer. Ooh. Let's try this again, shall we? What? What do you mean? Don't bong me with that! So here we are. Here we, go, huh? we finally have a chance yeah. to talk. Mm -hmm. Please hold your questions until I am done. I have good reasons for everything I have done so far. Alright, let's go. Good. Finally, somebody civil. So let's start at the beginning. This story starts 20 years ago when I was just a kid. At that age I heard a lot, seeing as my father was the overseer of this vault. It started with troubles with the water chip and low food stores. However, over the years it quickly grew into a much larger problem. Our water chip permanently broke and we were on our last rations of food. For years, my father had been working towards getting us out of here. He broadcast a distress signal every day, hoping it would reach the surface. When that didn't work, we started tunneling past our vault's walls. Luckily for us, there was quite a bit of equipment suited for digging. Eventually, we realized we were weeks away from being out of food. The people of this vault grew restless and started rioting. They blamed my father, even though he had tried for two decades to fix our problems. They brutally murdered both him and my mother. It was at this point that I had to do something. Me and my group of supporters managed to restore order, and I took over as overseer. Hmm? A month after my father's death, a trader from the town of Godfrey came upon our vault and released the door from the outside. He said that this was his first time in the area, but the distress signal could easily be heard by anyone that passed through the area regularly. The trader said that this was a path that was regularly traveled by people heading north from a city by the name of the Underground Railroad. So it was at this point that I realized that we had been blatantly ignored, left to die, cast out, and my parents were slaughtered because of it. Why couldn't you open from the inside? There was no console on the inside of the vault to open the door. It had to be opened from the outside. The door is essentially a two-foot-thick piece of steel, so drilling through it wasn't an option. So 
we try to dig to the surface instead? I'm not going to ask how they survived because they probably did cannibalism. I slaughter innocents. I already know that. Other people call you the plague. Guess they simply think that we act as a plague would. And honestly, that's a compliment. We strike fast, strike hard, and spread quickly. There. All right. <clears throat> Go on. Well, that's good to hear. You could be essential to us in the near future. Our evasion. We almost broken through the metro tunnel. The tunnel. Okay. So after you break through, then what? You attack. Then we follow the tunnel north until we reach the underground railroad. Then we strike from the inside. Hartrick will never see us coming. We'll finally be able to rid this town of the scum and villainy that has been bringing it down for years. But enough talk. We need somebody like you with experience and the grit to get things done. You have a choice to make. A choice that could potentially change the fate of Alton forever. The mic audio changed. And they didn't record this line. So will you join us or will I crush you into my heels? The decision you are about to make will determine the faction you play with for the rest of your stay in Alton. Once you have sided with a faction, there is no going back. And remember, factions in Alton aren't as black and white as you may believe. I mean, it's going to be the plague. 100%. Let's go. Now that's what I like to hear. Someone with sense. Someone who is willing to see reason. Now come, newcomer. We have much to do. Although I'm quite curious, what would happen if you were like... Yeah, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna join your enemy. Would they like not just kill you outright, or would they like be like, okay, we'll release you? Fair enough. We understand. Let's increase repair by like ten. Get up to like fifty. Um what else should I increase medicine to sixty. Not that I'll probably need it now, but let's increase energy guns by ten as well. Perfect. Actually, make that one an even forty. Got an extra one in science there. Right, next up we have. Hmm. Let's just get here and now. Yeah. Uh, okay. And the energy weapons. Gun. The last three I'll spend on long guns. Go. Next up, we have Lawbringer, which uh, when you have a Lawbringer perk, any evil character you kill will have a finger on their corpse. That nah, doesn't matter. Cyborg, a permanent made enhancement to your body. Cyborg perk adds ten percent to your damage, poison, and radiation resistance, and ten points to energy. We'll go with that one. Thank you. Wait, is it all my stuff? God. Why do they keep taking my stuff away? Our trick will never see us coming. All right, what? Speak up. Hello, newcomer. So, what do you do around here? I'm the one that makes sure everything runs smoothly around here. Anyone causes any problems, I have to deal with it. Later. get my gun back out please thank you Armin's lamentation yeah what if I could fix this with assault rifles we following this guy or what am I doing make sure double agent follow to a tour of vaults 57 are they gonna drag this out this is, is that where what we doing? previously spent most of our time tunneling upwards we since removed the scaffolding and equipment. They were tunneling upwards to try and get out of the vault. I feel like making such a big opening is is dumb. We could have just like tunneled in like one like sloped direction, you know? Or maybe multiple slopes. It could have been under a mountain. Gun, sir.
It's like I have chameleon armor on or something. It just changes whenever I'm like at a certain angle. <laughs> We're around rocks now, better take on the rock texture. This door. Oh, there, flag sniper. I'm gonna save before I take your stuff real quick. Thank you. Oink, oink. Bye. Steven, where'd you go? Even my friend. Living quarters, okay. Living quarters. Linda Roberts. Looking around scrawny. I'm new in town. Why are you wasting my time? Dare to be such a bitch? Did you go through what I have in your eyes? I brightened chair all the time. What happened? Helden ran out of me. He took something important in mind with him. That's something. Got a hole up in the Metro Tunnel with Godfrey. Uh, want me to help? Okay. Bye. Lost lover. Okay. Mars. Looks like a marketplace. So lost. How did he get so fast? He was just walking the whole time. This is our cafeteria. Whether you need beer or food, you'll find it here. You should probably clean up. I was like, he has just had a riot or something. Surely you could clean up a little bit. I almost tried, but I kind of gave up. They were like, nah, fuck. They cleaned like this little area and they were like, man, I don't get paid enough for this. And welcome to my office. Give the door for you, Mr. Overseer. Like he always has a teddy bear there. Orbtech, we'll be that. What up? Good view. So. Reminds me of all I grew up in. I like you. Could use a good cropping. Yeah, I'm mean, gonna say that. We've had more important things to deal with over the past few years. At least we've managed to scrub the graffiti from the riots. I mean, all it would take is like maybe an hour for someone to sweep a little bit, you know, my man? What happens now is vital. You're going to go back to the Underground Railroad, lie to Hartrick's face, and sabotage the place. You'll tell him that we capture you, but you managed to escape. Say anything necessary to get the proper clearance in certain parts of the railroad. You'll need to sabotage their water and food supply and deactivate any security systems present. This is all working towards our final goal, a full-blown invasion. We want as little standing in the way as possible. So, do you think you can handle it? Yeah. I would expect no less. Feel free to stop for a drink and stock up on supplies, but come back to me when this is all finished. Here are vials of... Well, just put one in the water and one in the food. It'll be sure to get them sick. Good luck, newcomer. Actually spreading plague. Oh my god, I love it. This is great. Empty lockers. Plague terminal. Shop! Okay. I'm gonna look at this real quick. One month. Oh, so it's the same thing that I read elsewhere. Okay, how do I get out of here now? Assuming it's going to be this way. Possibly. Going. Going. And this is the atrium, right? So if I were to build an exit, usually. It would be near the uh, atrium, right? Can you tell me how to get out of here, sir? Hello. What was this? Where am I at? The Geck Labs, okay. I think some of these doors have some problems. Living quarters don't do there. What about this door? Alright, it's a key. Okay. Fair. Hello. This is the X Labs, okay. 
I'm just gonna jump down here. Here and open the door. Here we go. The entrance. And more stim packs, thank you. Gains electronics, I'll take that. I'll just read that real quick. <clears throat> Here we go. Easy peasy. one's a trap. Back in the ATM living quarters. Why do the living quarters have a direct path to the vault entry? This. I was gonna laugh if there was like a control panel. It was gonna be hilarious. We don't have a way to get open the vault from our side, and yet there was like a panel there all along. Hilarious would that be. I mean the door is activated elsewhere. How? How we got out of here? Um, how do I get out of here? I mean, obviously, I, I can't. I guess they never tried to flip a switch to open the door. There's a control panel. So, I don't get it. Was it like maybe locked from the outside so they had to get it unlocked first before they could use that switch to open the door ever again? Or like, what? They said that they couldn't open it from inside, right? God, that's so loud. Hey, it's a nice little vibrant forest. That's pretty cool. Okay. So, next up, we need to go back to the Underground Railroad area. It'd be real nice if, like, the texture or the map work. Incidentally, why would I go back to the Underground Railroad and be like, hey, so the, uh... Uh, the plague captured me, but I broke free. You know, <laughs> finger guns. Great. Don't mind me. You know. Why would I not just be like, hey man, I, uh, I've been helping people out. and You know, I'm just great. Just run their trust that way. Are they going to be like, hmm, oh, you escaped? Well, I guess we'll just, uh, Give you clearance to the whole area then. Here, you can go to our food place for some reason. Water access? Yeah, here you go. Welcome back. I uh, killed some mutants. Not much exciting happened. Not much exciting happened. I called clearing out of town to take some tall monsters pretty exciting. Has Robert given you the keys to this ride yet? Not yet. Said isn't ready for the road. Ah, well, he must have his reasons. For the time being, I have a small job for me to do. The water line's been leaking for a while now. It all gets pumped in only after spring was done a few years ago. If you could fix it for us, that would be great. Sure, I'll fix it. Great. Here's the key. The cave's towards the end of the tunnel. Good luck. Okay, so I got access to the water. Sabotage, the Underground Railroads, food and water. Yep. Hmm. Oh, hello. 
Hello. Why me? Just we're in full plague armor. Just gonna walk over here. Don't mind me. Don't mind me at all. Uh, I spit into the water. Little cabinet. What a uh, go down here. Here. Why am I going so far in? I guess I need to repair the pipe to make it look like I did stuff. Oh, I guess. Oh yay, swimming. Here's the pump. Interact with it or activate water pipe. Move disgusting vial. Yeah. Easy peasy. Now let's go sabotage the food. Do do. Here. Looks like the food is around this way. How do people live like this? Oh my god. They need to like clean up their like living quarters. Where am I going? This is their cafeteria. Just all the way over here, huh? Oh my god, that's bright. Back in my hat. Back to my food container. Custom vial has been removed. Um, I'm gonna take all these ice cold new controllers, thank you. My payment. I'm gonna chug them real quick because now I'm overweight. Yeah. Okay. Now I just need to go back downstairs. Imagine coming through like this place just to go to like eat. Weird. Why is there like a freezer in that particular area of like a, a metro? I've only seen like five people living here. Zombie. Yo, mate, it's fixed. Hey, thanks a lot. Looks like the water. I will fight against the plague. Line of attack. Security codes are encrypted many times over, making them impossible to hack. What are the security codes? Next, we have security checkpoints along the utility. We block the one that leads into the utility tunnel, so that one's covered. Finally, we have turrets along our greatest weak point, a metro tunnel that runs close to Vault 59, but that tunnel was sealed off long ago. The good thing, though, is that nobody knows about it except us. The tunnel has been blocked off since the Great War. 
Mike had a digging equipment. The only place the tunnel actually spits out is here, through some utility tunnels. Luckily, those are both very well sealed. Thank you for telling me all this very sensitive information about your base. I don't know why I'm telling you all this. Thanks. Yeah, anything for a friend. I'll uh, See. I'll go sabotage the gag. Let me just let me just hide in this corner real quick and take the security pass key. Bye. Wait. Up to something else in here again? What am I doing here still? The actually they're going to railroad security system. Uh oh. Eh. You just hop back up here again. Oh, I lost karma. Aww. Siding with the bad guys lose me karma. Mm -hmm. What's my next objective? The actually they're going to railroad security system. This way I gotta go. I feel like it's maybe not. It really feels like not. Nope. Other tunnel it is. Well, shoot. Hmm. You think this mod ends after I, uh, Help them. Where am I going? This is like right here. Well, I'm just gonna toggle control. I'm gonna move this wall real quick. This is confusing. What the hell? I gotta go up and over, and then I need to go here. Okay, I'm just gonna. Hmm. I don't wanna. Am I still collision? Oh. Okay, off means that one. Okay. Anyway, air controls. Deactivate. Bye. Ah, I've been here before. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah I remember now. This way? Yep, okay. It's like there's where I use the flight thing at. Okay. Hello. Goodbye. Yes. No, nothing. Bye. Hello, goodbye. Hello. I've never seen you around. Is, are you guys threatening? What do you got? You a drug dealer? Yeah, you're a drug dealer. Of course you're a drug dealer. You look shady as hell. Okay, bye. So, when I chose to side with the plague, they were like, things aren't always black and white. <laughs> right? But like... I don't know. It seems like the vault dwellers here in particular are kind of evil. You guys kidding me? You really, you really stopped me from fast traveling up there, huh? I'm just go over here. Can I do it now? And, okay. Peace! Oh god, that's the medics wearing off. Okay. And the door had weird textures on here. No! Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm, I'm not gonna wait for the door to open again. There we go. Hmm. 
Where are the stairs at, my mans? The stairs? Yes. Hello, Sally. These people are actually named. How many named characters do we see in the uh, the railroad? Like two. Main guy and then Tom. And I guess the one guy who was like escorting me around, but or him. Everyone else was just like. The ground railroad person. Big cat, thank you though. How do I get up to see this overseer? My revolt's so confusing. I don't want to go down. Dag it. Maybe the other side has stairs going up. It is not. Okay, well, maybe if I continue to wander through the halls aimlessly, I will eventually find a way. I go up. We'll see. Here we go. Cafeteria. <clears throat> Here, yes, yeah, sir. Well, the deed's Welcome done, mate. Back. What have you? I don't remember. Was plan to sabotage the city in some way. We did. Then we'll erect security around the entrance. Anybody without a card won't be able to enter. Have you lowered your defenses? Yep. Security is offline, the water's tainted, and their food is spoiled. Good. Here's a reward. Now we can finally move towards getting in. We've got one problem, though. We don't have the explosives. Oh, man. Beyond a wall in the caves below lies a metro tunnel that will lead us to the Underground Railroad. We're going to need to remove this wall. We're going to need a lot of explosives, but not of the standard variety. What we need a lot of is C4. Unfortunately, the only place in Alton where any would be is in prime Deathclaw territory, at the old Alton Quarry. Think you can handle it? Yeah. Now that's what I like to hear. The old quarry is in northeastern Alton, a ways north from New Godfrey. Unfortunately, it's not as easy as just going in and grabbing the C4. You're going to have to head into the old Brotherhood bunker that's in the quarry. When they set up camp, they cleared the quarry of its equipment. You'll be able to find the explosives somewhere in there. When you find them, report back to me, and we'll get to work on this wall. Good luck. Julio. Level up? Nope, not quite yet. Okay. Well. Uncharted territory. Let me see here. Okay, well, I think for right now, I will go ahead and just wrap things up for this uh, playthrough bit. And then next time I pick the game up, we will continue on with uh, finishing Alton. Because it doesn't seem like it's going to go that much longer. Uh, it feels like all we're going to do is get the C4, do the attack. And then that'll be that, right? No, that will be that. But who knows, there might be some extra stuff, such as, you know, going from the, uh, from the victory party to them needing me to do some extra stuff to help them uh, get me going to where we're going to be going home. That, of course. So, uh, See that, but for now we'll end that there. And like I said, once we're done with Alton, I have a, a couple other uh, mods to check out that I plan on playing. Uh, with Fallout 3, there's the, the Fallout Zero mod, which uh, looks like it might actually be bigger and more like better thought out than Alton, which uh, it looks like it has a lot of like subways and stuff that goes through it. and it looks like i think it's on the east coast because i see hollywood on this map they have um in addition to that one there's also uh beyond a boulder dome which is a fallout new vegas mod which uh 
You go to Boulder, Colorado, which seems also pretty, pretty uh, well thought out and stuff. The trailer, they actually have a trailer, which is cool. And then you have a trailer, that's usually a good sign. I couldn't find one of Alton North, but it looks promising, the Boulder Dome one. And then finally, uh, we have Fallout New California, which is also a Las Vegas mod, or a New Vegas mod, I should say. And uh, it seems to be the best one that I currently have av available that I can play right now. Um, just from overall looks and design and the various like implementation of how things went and like the, uh, the size of the map. Uh, hell, it looks like it, it includes Junktown, Necropolis, Glow, stuff from like the original Fallout games. Or at least that might be a map of... There's a map that shows that stuff, but I'm not sure if it's going to be actually in the game or if that's just like a reference to that. that they have. Um, regardless... That one's going to be fun. So stay tuned for that in the coming weeks or whenever I get around to it. I think we'll finish with Alton and we'll move on to the other Fallout 3 one, which is uh, Zero. And after that, we'll do the, the New California one, Fallout New Vegas. And we'll finish up with Baldur Dome and be done with all the Fallout full conversions, unless somehow the, uh, the ones I'm keeping an eye on finish after that. But we'll see. Anyway, thank you all for sticking around, hanging out, and checking out the video. And, uh, yeah. I will summarize my thoughts on Alton when we actually complete the, the mod. But now, it's not too bad, but it's not the most amazing thing. So, until next time, everyone. Bye-bye.